Hey. My hair looks so bad right now. <sighs> okay, I'm back. I've been seeing a lot of videos of people customizing things. Like a lot, and they're all using the same freaking thumbnail. It's like annoying, but I'm gonna do it. Except I'm not going to the extreme that they're going to. Like the Dolan twins literally customized the car. I'm not gonna do that. Oh. I do have this old pair of Converse. They have like pink paint on them because, so I wore them to life in color and they got like pink and green paint all over them. Ooh. Um, I'm thinking, so I have white, black, and yellow. And I'm thinking I'm just gonna put a bunch of yellow things all over them. If I find an inspo pick, I'll put it here. But I'm, I don't really have an inspo pick. It's kind of just up here. But we're gonna see how they turn out. First, I started drawing out what I wanted them to look like just so I could get an idea of how I wanted them to look. So this is what I'm going for. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna freehand everything. Should I move this back? This is stressful. First, I'm gonna dump my paint out. I'm picking out my brushes first, actually. This, so this looks like a good brush. This is a 0.2, no, I'm just kidding. I don't know anything about paint. Oh, this is a really small one. We're gonna need her for details. Oh, that's a tiny guy. That's a lot. I probably didn't need that much. I feel like we're gonna be making a lot of shades of yellow so that everything looks different. I actually kind of want to make this look really good. Oh, I'm kind of scared. I guess we kind of just have to wing this, honestly. Let's make some honeycomb. Okay, this is gonna look really stupid, I think. <laughs> There's our honeycomb. <laughs> we could do better. I'm honestly okay if I ruin these because they were already ruined and I was never wearing them, so. There's my bee and honeycomb. Aww. Does that look brown to you? No, it looks purple. All right, the sunflower actually looks pretty good. I don't know what I should draw next. Smiley face. Maybe I should do this one with blue stuff, except I don't think I have blue paint, but that would be so cool. All right, well, I'm gonna fast forward this because I don't think you wanna watch me draw like 400 different. Let's fast forward. Okay, okay, time lapse. Bye. I totally just fucked up the banana. Oops. make the other one like blue stuff but this I only have watercolor so we're gonna see how this goes I don't know if it'll show up or not oh that is not gonna work well, maybe it will it looks kind of gross first I'm gonna draw a butterfly I need to draw a butterfly the ocean sorry come on I'm beating the devil out of my brush my lightning symbol sucks oh well no going back now all right, well, I fucked up the butterfly. It looks good from far away, but when you get up close, she don't look good. You know what? I'll update you when I'm done. Time lapse. Okay, so I just finished. I'm gonna let them dry a little bit first, obviously. Here they are, haha, <laughs> just kidding. This is the other side. Oh my God, that looks so cool on camera. I'm gonna blur this first so that you guys can't see it, but holy shit, this looks so cool on camera. <laughs> and then I started to paint my hand and don't lie, we all do this whenever we paint. Hopefully it works. Cool. I feel like I'm in like elementary school again. <laughs> Be right back. I'm gonna give you guys the final reveal. I think they look kind of cool. They're not like, I'm not like an artist, but I'm not terrible. Three, two, one. Ping! Ta da! <laughs> These ones say chill out on the side. 
And then this one says, uh-huh, honey. You know that Brandy Melville thing? These are the finished shoes. I think they look so good. This one's missing its shoelace because I wear this shoelace as a shoelace belt, but I'm gonna put it back in for now. So here are the shoes. We got the yellow one and the blue one. LOL, that block of cheese did not turn out well. And then a sunflower on the toe. And then this is the toe of this one. It's just the ocean. Those are the shoes. Let's put them in an outfit. So I would say that the aesthetic I'm going for is like art ho because obviously um, if you couldn't tell, I'm an artist. Ooh, are the pineapple socks too much? Ooh, they might be. Let me change the socks, hold on. So these jeans are insanely tight on me. I'm like sweating putting these shoes on and these jeans are just, and the sweater is so hot. It's like 70 degrees outside. <gasps> they're cute. Oh my God, they're so cool. This is my outfit. I went for an art ho vibe, an art ho aesthetic vibe thing because I think these shoes make me very artsy. I put this scrunchie in for the blue and then I have this striped like turtleneck sweater for the yellow. I need to take this outfit off before I sweat my ass off. So um, I'm just gonna end this video here. I think the shoes turned out really well. Um, which one's cooler guys, the blue or the yellow? Oh, they, they both look so cool. Okay, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, leave a like if you did, subscribe. That's all I have to say. If you wanna see me do more art, I did a Bob Ross tutorial on my chalkboard wall over there. Okay, I'm sweating, I need to get out of this. Bye, see you guys next time, thanks for watching. See ya.